those of you that have anointing water, I just want to minister it to you to let you know what you have. Anointed Can water, oil, it? handkerchief, and other spiritual Raise items are the on. weapons of our warfare. Tell Jesus! Spread it on air! See, I'm rubber! See, I'm rubber! I'm a rubber, I'm also a, a goddess. I took a block book. You are what? I'm a rubber, also a, a goddess. Who have anointing water? Okay, come here. Tell him to stand up and answer. Oh, yeah. Stand up and hands up in Jesus' name. Tell him to stand answer. Stand up hands up in Jesus' name. T hands up. Hands up. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Look, the name hey, of Jesus. say it to do like this. Hold your hand on your ear. Jump up. In the name of Jesus. Jump up. Hold your hand on. Jump up. In the name of Jesus. Jump up 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 in the name of Jesus. Watch the screen. In the name of Jesus. In most Christian societies today, especially in Nigeria, Cameroon, Ghana, and other African countries, jungle justice seemed to be the order of the day, as when thieves are caught red-handed, they are either mercilessly beaten to the point of death by an angry mob or set ablaze, especially if the thief is a notorious one that has been a thorn to the flesh of people in a particular community. Jungle justice is often served in an attempt to get rid of the thief or to scare people from getting involved in the act. However, despite the huge number of thieves that have been gotten rid of via the dreaded jungle justice system, we will all agree that crime wave has instead increased in 2024. And the simple reason is jungle justice doesn't kill the evil spirit responsible for all the killings, stealing, and destruction in our society. In 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 4, the Bible makes us to understand that as Christians, the weapons of our warfare are not canal, for we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against the authorities, against the cosmic powers over this present darkness, against the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly places. Ephesians chapter 6, verse 12. In this video, senior prophet T.B. Joshua shows Christians how to deliver and capture hardened criminals without resorting to jungle justice or leaving a single bruise on their body. This is how jungle justice ought to be served in a Christian society as demonstrated in the scone. Watch and learn from God's general. Those of you that have anointing water, I just want to minister it to you to let you know what you have on. Can you open it, raise it up, and stand up? Who just stretch it forward for the benefit of those who have no anointing water? Anointed water, oil, handkerchief, and other spiritual items are the weapons of our warfare. Whether you have or not, all I know, once you spread it on the air now, whether it fall on your cloth or your body, it catch fire. Tell Jesus! Jesus! Spread it on air! See what is happening? People falling one on top of another. The anointing of God is flowing right now. See what is happening? As he led them in prayer and they began to spray the anointing water, the mighty power of God fished out all the unclean spirits in their midst. See, I'm rubber! See, I'm rubber! I'm a, a robot, I'm also a, a goddess. I took a block book. You are what? I'm a robot, also a, a goddess. As the prey continues, this man, who is an armed robber and a cultist, is fished out, and the evil spirit within him is forced to confess. Spray your anointing water, see. Watch, watch, watch. Watch your screen. Watch, watch. Watch your screen. Watch, watch. The brother says, an armed robber and a cultist. The man of God instructed people among the congregation to spray the anointing water towards the man who confessed to being an armed robber and cultist. Unable to stand the mighty power of God, he rolls back and forth on the floor, and feeling uneasy due to the fire of the Holy Ghost, he begins to pull off his clothes. The fire is clearly too much for him, and he tries with all his might to pat out the invisible flames. Who have anointing water? Okay, come here. Tell him to stand up and answer. Oh, yeah. Stand up and hands up in Jesus' name. Tell him to answer. Stand up and hands up in Jesus' name. T hands him. up. Hands up in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Is 
a vu que l'homme de Dieu a demandé à cet homme de le commander look, de se lever look, dans le nom hey, de Jésus. Say it to do that day. Hold your hand on your ear. Jump up. In the name of Jesus. Jump up. Hold your hand on your ear. Jump up. In the name of Jesus. 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 Watch the screen. In the name of Jesus. At the instruction of the man of God, he commanded the exposed arm robber and cultist to jump in the name of Jesus Christ. And the man was forced to jump. In the name of Jesus, I command you to jump. Jump and go. You can see it. These are the people terrorizing us out there. He said it's an arm robber and a cultist, and you can see what the power of God. Okay, ask him to stand up again. Spread it. Stand up in the name of Jesus. I command you to stand up in the mighty name of Say Jesus. Say to jump. Jump up. Stand up. It should jump up. up. Put one hand on your ear and jump up. In the mighty name of Jesus. Jump. Jump in the name of Jesus. Jump in the mighty name of Jesus. Jump in the mighty name of Jesus. Jump in the mighty name Amen. of Jesus. Amen. Amen. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. Tell him to go and sit down. Oh yeah, come back. Come back in the name of Jesus. I command you. Come back in the name of Jesus. Come back. Come back. Back in the name of Jesus. Come back in the name of Jesus. Come back in the name of Jesus. Tell him to sit down. Sit down. Oh yeah, sit on the floor. In the mighty name of Jesus. Stand up, stand up, two of you. See. Come here. Stand here. Τι είχε γίνει στον άντρα που στεκόταν εδώ και τώρα θα μας δείξει κάτι άλλο. See. I'm coming. <laughs> okay, hold stand up. Carry it. Put your Bible down. Courage. And call the name Jesus. Why is my giving? Call the name Jesus Christ. And ask them in the name of Jesus that this bag, they will not be able to collect it from you. Let's assume they are thief. Yes. Assume they are thief. Yes. And they want to carry your bag. Yes. And yes. assume you, you are facing trouble yes. with thief. Yes. And the two of them are thief. And you are a born again. Yes. You want to call the name Jesus that in the name of Jesus, yes. this bag, yes. they will not be able to collect I it from mean. you. And I will ask them to move and collect <laughs> it as it says here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. Call the name Jesus. So you see, by the time this man stretching hand, yeah. he, will, he will try to get it, yeah. but the name Jesus will arrest him. Yes. You can now even command them, fall! You ask them, fall, yeah. move! Yeah. Anything you want to say. Yeah. <laughs> in the name of Jesus! You will not steal this bag from me. In the name of Jesus, fall. In the name of Jesus, leave me. Amen. When you call the name Jesus, I want you to come and try and collect it and see. And you command. Uh Jesus, 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 leave me. (laughs) What can you say about what you are seeing here? Because I see you want to cry. I just see. You want to cry. That what has happened? I, I just feel... Something. God is great. It, People are crying. What what can you say? Yeah. What is happening? I just feel I sense the presence of the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. If you don't ask them to stand up, they will not stand up. Yeah. If let's assume they are teeth. Yes. They will be there forever and ever. <laughs> the police will not come and carry them. They will fall down there and they will remain there. Ask them to stand up. Now, in the name of Jesus, Gary, and what's his name? Goody. See the hand, see the hand. Come on, stand up in the see name the of Jesus. See the hand, the hand is shaking. <laughs> Look the power of the Holy Look at the hand, the hand is shaking. <laughs> in the name of Jesus, stand up. Stand up. Stand up, stand up in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Wait, come, come, come. You know, in a normal way, two of them can beat this woman. You know, they can beat her. Yeah. 
you know but with the name of Jesus they cannot be this woman Alla in the name of Jesus Christ they cannot be able to hurt you not to hurt you okay I want you to come here come here you come here I want I want you to fight this woman but shout the name Jesus when they, they allow them that them beat you first before you shout the name Jesus and see what will happen to them Palepse din prata ta ti palepsune ke meta ta pi en donom ti tu Jesus Christ okay So when they give you punch, yes. you judge Jesus. Uh-huh. Two of you, Robert. Jesus! 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 I command you in the name of Jesus. What <laughs> <laughs> a demonstration of the power of God. You got it all. Hallelujah. 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 Let's give Jesus a clap. My name is uh, Christian Angomno, aged by tw- 25 years. I'm a courtist. I'm also an Arab. It all started 2007 when I traveled out of the country. I was deported in 2008. Left with me nothing. So I began to roam about in the streets, start smoke uh, Indian and cigarette and mingle up with the bad guys. So later on, it was then I met a friend. What really motivates me to join the court is that the way they lavish money, they can eat a uh, hundred thousand naira at a flow. So I began to ask him, say, my friend, ah, can I put me through? So I would really like to be among. They now say, okay, if I'm willing to keep to the rules, I said, I'm willing to do anything. They now asked me to see me three days time. I now called him. He now said, okay, that he's going to take me to our leader. So I said, okay. So after two weeks interval, they now called me to come. Then I went to go and see them. They took me to one big forest, asked me to off my clothes, which I did. Also asked me to raise my hand. They tied my hand. They asked me to lie down. Then I lie down. They were 10 in the number. They lashed me 25 strokes of machete drilling. Also, I used a razor blade to tear my left hand. Then they asked me to take my blood and keep whatever thing that we did with him. I said that I shouldn't reveal our secret. I told them, okay, I will not do that. So after a week interval, they now called me, okay, there is a mission that we're going to take place. They brought out arm and the cutlass and also axe. They gave me one arm for me to carry out a mission with them. Then we'll go successful and come back. So after three days, they called me for another mission. On our way, uh, police took, uh, took us on our way. They shot two of our gang instantly dead. I went to Habalis for me to give me charm so that bullets would not penetrate on my body, which uh, the Habalis did on me. They called us again for mission. We lost three souls, then the remaining six of us. I have charm in my body, which I use in carry the op- oppression. This is Christian Anomnu, the armed robber and cultist, who is now receiving deliverance in the power of the Holy Spirit after he has given his confession. You are delivered in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. And that's it. If you enjoyed the video and want more like it, be sure to leave a thumbs up below in appreciation. And if you haven't already, you really want to subscribe. Subscribe to my channel and tick the bell icon so you get notified as I upload a new video every week. See you in the next video.